everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to day 190 of trying a new makeup product every day. I can't believe how close to 200 days I am. Oh my gosh, I'm still not sure what I'm going to do to celebrate 200 days, but hopefully it'll be something exciting. But today I'm going to be trying out the Ardell Natural 117 Black False Eyelashes. I chose these because I like how long they are but I also like how full, but what really draws me in to a lash is the baseline because this is basically an invisible lash line. So it's not like a thick strip. It's just tiny individual kind of bases of a lash. And I find that those look better on me, less obvious that I'm wearing false eyelashes. And that's kind of the look I like to go for is natural, but still an oomph my eyelashes. So these retail for only $4.99 at Ulta and I did already put on mascara and I lined my eyes with black eyeliner on top. So my first step with the new pair of eyelashes is to see if I have to trim them. So I will gently peel it out of the package and I know that this one goes on my right eye because if you turn the package as if it matches up with your eyes in the direction of your eyelashes, you can tell which lash pair goes to which eye. That actually looks like a really nice fit for me. Usually I have to trim like one little eyelash section off. Wow, this one, like it looks like it barely is gonna fit. It looks like it might even be a little too short, but I can kind of stretch it and make it work. That's so interesting though. Usually eyelashes come really long. It's okay though. It's important to trim your eyelashes so that it doesn't give you a weird eye shape. And everyone's eye is different, so you have to trim it to your specific eye shape. <laughs> when I put lashes on my sister, her eyes are I guess a lot smaller than mine. I end up cutting like a third of the eyelash off of my sister and then I'm like, I only had to cut one off. Like we have very different eyes and we're sisters. So it just goes to show like everyone's eyes are different. You have to make sure you trim it to your correct length. The next step is to apply the adhesive. I use Ardell Lash Grip and this is the clear version. Okay, so I make sure that there's a light layer along the entire base of the lashes and I pay extra attention to the ends because I really need to make sure that the ends stick down. And then you give it like 30 seconds to a minute for the glue to become a bit more tacky and less liquidy and that helps it apply better onto your eyes. I try and give special attention to make sure that the eyelashes are facing upwards because I do tend to apply them somehow in kind of like a straight out direction. So I have to remind myself to make sure that the eyelashes go up so that when my eyes open, you can tell that I have eyelashes and if they're going out straight, it doesn't look like I'm wearing long eyelashes. And then I just try and get the lash line as close to my natural eyelash base as possible. And it does help me to line my upper lid with the dark eyeliner so then I can see kind of where I need to place it. And then I'll also pinch my natural lashes with the false eyelashes to help them blend. All right, so here is the difference. My eyelashes with the Ardell 117s on versus without. I feel like these are looking so pretty. I'm really liking how long and full they are. I'm gonna go ahead and apply the other pair and I'll come back with my final thoughts. Okay, so here is my finished look. And wow, I feel like my eyes look more dramatic, more doll-like. So I'm pretty happy with these lashes. I really like how comfortable they feel. They're pretty light, like it barely feels like I'm wearing false eyelashes, which is really nice because a lot of times they're very uncomfortable for me. And basically I just like these because they're so long 
and they're evenly dispersed. It's been a little while since I've worn false eyelashes, so it's kind of taking some getting used to, but I'm pretty happy. I'm not like blown away by these. I'm kind of on a search now for my perfect false eyelashes, but I did just buy a bunch of false eyelashes from Shop Miss A. So look forward to those in a future video. Maybe I'll find some really good and expensive lashes from there. I actually bought a lot from the Shop Miss A website. I finally got around to placing an order online and I can't wait for it to get here and try out all of the different products. But I'm definitely a fan of Ardell lashes. I think they're very affordable but good quality because you can continue to use them over and over. So. These ones are nice. I don't think they're my favorite lashes that I've tried out from Ardell. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of these ones. Funny that they're called natural, but not looking very natural to me because they're very long. Thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.